Hey everyone, welcome to Software Testing Mentor and RCV Academy. And in this video, we are going to understand about AI powered test automation. We'll understand about what exactly is AI powered test automation, what are some of its key features, what are some of the popular tools available nowadays that will be used for AI powered test automation or being used for AI powered test automation. I'll be covering some of these tools as part of the tutorial series in upcoming tutorials. So what exactly is AI powered test automation? So when we say AI powered AI stands for the artificial intelligence it when we say using AI in test automation or AI powered test automation it is about the usage of uh, it is about the it is about the usage of artificial intelligence and machine learning into software testing into the test automation so that you can create your test cases faster you can have the inherent capabilities to fix the failing issues that are very common or used to be very common in say for example traditional selenium scripts locator flakiness was very very common previously so ai and machine learning these algorithms help us to auto heal or these tools when they have the artificial intelligence capabilities they help us to auto heal the locators that used to fail so what actually is ai powered test automation there are many capabilities the first thing is about generating the test cases automatically so these ai powered test automation tool can generate your test cases automatically doesn't matter it's ui automation tool or api automation tool so say for example you are using postman or you are already using the latest version of postman postman has the capability to create your api test cases automatically to create those scripts automatically it will suggest based on the endpoint you can create those endpoints or create those scripts for the endpoints automatically for the common scenarios based on the documentation if you have the documentation you provide or based on the endpoint similarly for the ui you can create those or generate those test cases automatically by prompting then self-healing the selectors are still flaky or can be flaky not as flaky as it used to be but when you have the ai capability within the test automation tool the self-healing happens so in case the selector has broken or is uh, the script is not able to identify the locator the ai capability within the tool will self-heal and automatically try to find out the updated locator and go ahead and execute the script then these tools can also predict bugs or and optimize the test coverage when we say optimize the test coverage they can suggest you the gaps in the test cases so if you have the api endpoint and you have written some of the test cases these tools will suggest you further more test cases or identify the gaps if more test cases are required so these are some of the common features and the basic features that are available in the ai ai power test automation tools now if we talk about the key features so self-healing scripts then you have the visual testing so in visual testing ai capabilities can be used to identify what has changed visually on the ui layout and based on that you will get recommendation about any of the issues that might have happened or changes that that might have happened on the ui which are not intended so these are some of the features then some of the popular ai test automation tool if we talk about so open source selenium you do not have any inherent ai capability within selenium but then there are plugins now any open source tool in future maybe there will be capability or ai capability built in within the library itself but still nowadays or or currently as well there are capabilities or plugins that you can integrate selenium with for auto healing of the locators for example helenium is there that you can integrate with selenium and that will help you to auto heal the any failing locators then there are many other ai plugins that can be integrated with open source tool for example selenium and playwright as well so you can also have not only just going through the proprietary or paid tool you can even in the open source tool if you explore you will be able to find the capabilities for doing the visual testing which has the ai capabilities for doing the auto healing of the locator 
you will get the plugins for playwright and for selenium as well but then there are paid tools as well and some of the popular paid tools are for example apply tools is very popular for the visual testing and then you have test team you have test trigger these are some of the paid tools or paid ai testing tools i'll try to create some of the functionalities around these tools i'll go ahead and sign up for the free account for the tools whichever are available and then explain you what all capabilities these test tools provide or what all ai capabilities these test tools will provide so in case you want to go ahead and understand how these how the ai capabilities look within these tools and what these tools can do for you in your test automation you can then understand from those videos so very soon i'll be coming up with those videos as well now why exactly this ai matters in the test automation the reason being that we cannot anymore go ahead with the traditional flakiness and the slowness that that was there with the ai capabilities we have to adapt ourselves to the fast pace delivery cycle and the release cycle why because now ai is our helper it's kind of a assistant for us to do tasks quickly and do not get or do not waste the time on the activities that we used to do for example in testing we used to fix all of the failing locators manually right now with the ai coming picture if we have the ai plugin if we have the open source tool itself say for example selenium or playwright we can in integrate the ai plugin for example helenium to do the auto healing of the locator so that solves our problem and it expedites our testing cycle and any of the locator failures can be fixed automatically then test case gen generators for example generating the test case automatically we can use those or we can use the prompt engineering to generate the test case then we have the ai, AI capabilities within the tool for example postman if you are doing api testing writing the automated script using the ai capability of the tool makes us to write the test case faster and from our expertise perspective from testing expertise pr perspective we just go ahead and analyze those automated or automatically suggested test cases and accept those or if there are any gap then we add those new test cases that we can think of that the tool hasn't suggested us so that's why the ai powered test automation tool matter because they help us to expedite our overall testing process and to ensure that we can adapt to the fast paced release cycle and add more value from because we are the thinkers the testers are the thinkers anything that tool can do for us will leverage that and then what wherever we should be focusing more thinking around the gap or the shortcomings of the tool will identify those areas and will put more effort there and test more efficiently will get more coverage that's where these tools are important these tools are not there to replace the whole job as such it's just to make us more capable to get more coverage and have more quality product delivered in the market so that's why the ai powered test automation tool matter and we should be regularly using them to enhance our testing and quality approach so that's all for this video in the next tutorial i'll cover some other popular software testing and test automation topic on this channel thank you see you in the next one